Hello friends, today I am going to share with you how you can bypass FRP lock on Galaxy J6 Plus. So first of all, we need to connect it with Wi-Fi. Then we need to connect our mobile with PC and open Samsung FRP tool in computer. The link is in description, you can download it from there. So as you can see, I am just going to give my Wi-Fi password. In case you face YouTube update message, you can hard reset your mobile and try it again. Hopefully your problem will solve. So as you can see mobile is connected with Wi-Fi. Now we just need to click on the bypass FRP. Bypass FRP. OK. And this will show a pop up message on your mobile screen. So just wait for the pop up message. Click on the view button. And now this will let you go to Google Chrome. Just wait a little bit. Click accept and continue. No thanks. Now we are in Google Chrome. So here we just need to find FRP Faisal from FaisalMobile.com. So I will just type here FRP Faisal. You will see the first link. Just click on it and now you just need to scroll down and here you need to click on set lock screen as you can see it's not working now you just need to click on align shield x galaxy store cancel the ad now this will let you go to galaxy store directly otherwise galaxy store will ask for the update to avoid the update you need to click on align shield x so this will let you go to directly in galaxy store so here we just need to give our samsung account and password if you don't have samsung account please create it first then log in here as you can see i am just going to give my password now it will ask for the verification so we just need to verify it with our registered mobile number click on the install button and as you can see align shield x is just going to install it can take a few minutes depend on your internet speed So as you can see it's installing now. After the installation finish you just need to open it. Click here to open it and here we need to log in with username and password. Just got it and if you don't have username and password you can create it from the Line Shield X website. You can watch my video on it, how to create Line Shield X username and password. Just sign in. Now just click next. Device admin must be activate. Just click on the activate button. Click next. Now just need to activate the Knox. So give permission. It can take a few seconds over here. So just wait for to activate the Knox. As you can see Knox is activated now. Just click on the finish button. Now click app manager. And now you will see the app manager. It can take a few seconds. So just wait a little bit. Now search here. service mode service space mode click here now just click on the activities scroll down at the last three number open it now click on MTP plus ADB select it now our adb is on now you just need to connect your mobile with pc and open samfirm ai tool 
version 3 or you can use any version which you want so just click on the adb section and reset frp click here now just give permission from mobile and this will reset your frp lock and phone will be restart as you can see phone will be restart and your frp will gone so just wait to restart your mobile it can take a few seconds so just need to wait to start the mobile this method also works on android 10 11 or 12 you can use this method on other samsung models as well so you can see this will delete the frp lock phone is just going to start and if this work for you please do comment in the comment section with the date and model number so other people can also get help as you can see phone is started up just scroll up okay sometime it can take a few minutes over here so just wait to finish the setup don't hesitate just wait to start the mobile as you can see it's blinking now now our phone is started up and now you just need to reset your mobile and this will be okay and there will be no frp lock or google lock so just go to settings and here we need to reset our mobile go to account and backup just click on the reset button just remove samsung account first i just need to sign out my samsung account just give your password over here and after that you need to reset hard reset your mobile now just click on the about account and backup reset factory data reset just reset and delete all now this will delete all your data and your phone will be bypass frp lock or google lock so just sit behind and wait for it to finish the restart process it can take 5 to 10 minutes so just wait to finish the process now our phone is started up successfully and there is no frp lock or google lock and if this video is helpful for you please do comment in the comment section and subscribe like and share see you in the next video till then bye bye